What? I just got a notification from the Facebook Marketplace on my phone. I thought someone had texted me or something. But I just got a text that was like, you should buy this off the Facebook Marketplace. I have never bought anything off the Facebook Marketplace, so this must be something fantastic if I'm getting a notification for this. It's a ATM. What? I've never once purchased anything off the Facebook Marketplace, and I'm not going to start with an ATM. That looks like it was stolen, like someone fucking ripped it out of a wall. Buy it and open it on stream? Well, it's free. Oh, the it's a cursive figure with removable clothes? Yeah, I wish that was what was recommended to me now. Can, will this, does this show on stream? It's literally just a free ATM, and I got a notification for this. Free ATM. Oh, it's placement? Oh, we place our ATM at your business. That's still, what the fuck? Oh my god, this is also a weird thing. This guy is giving away the free keys to his old car. So he sold, the, what the fuck is Facebook Marketplace, bro? So I can't, it says this guy's address, so I can't, um... I'm not gonna read his address, but I, what the fuck, dude? I guess maybe I should look at Facebook Marketplace. Free 2003 Lexus 330 keys. I sold the car, so I don't need the spare key anymore. Why did you not get the spare key? Give the spare key to the person who bought your car. This is like a super douchey thing to do, right? You're setting this guy up to get the car stolen. It's like a fucking treasure map. <laughs> and then he leaves it. He's cut. He said, "Come and get them in my house." And then he lists his address. Do not message me. First come, first serve. As soon as the keys are gone, I'll take down this page. It's a spare key. Yeah, but that's what's weird, right? Basically, you're giving away- you sold the car, and then you're, like, giving away the spare key of, like, go find the fucking car, here you go. <laughs> Steal the car side quest. Like, what? <laughs> it's like when you get a key item in, a, like, an RPG and you don't know what it's for. <laughs> and, like, randomly, like, you're going across, like, the mall grocery store parking lot and you're honking the, the lock button. And then it's like, oh, oh you found the car. <laughs> You can see in the picture, he just has the car keys, like, they're on his, like, doormat. <laughs> and then so you just go around town, like, hitting the lock button. And then someone's like, you stole the car! And you're like, no, I've got the keys right here. What the f what?! Someone's giving away their school pictures on Facebook?! Why would I want your school photos? The guy's giving away his school photos. Remember Jeremy from that school I never attended? <laughs> do a uh, Facebook Marketplace stream? I feel like I'd have to do, if I did a Facebook Marketplace stream, it'd have to be for like an area not where I live. Cause then I'm gonna like dox myself. But it would be, I mean, it would be funny. I don't know. I mean, you guys aren't gonna like show up at my house, right? That, that would, wouldn't happen, yeah? Oh, speaking of Facebook Marketplace, I had a really weird thing happen today where, um... So I wanted to, um... I went out... I went like, outside today to go run some errands, and, like, as I was leaving the house, or my apartment, like, it was storming out. So, like, when I left my apartment, there's, like, the packages that are, like, outside my apartment complex. Because you can't just, like, walk into my apartment complex. There's, like, um... You have to have the building key to get inside the building. And so, because it was storming, I took everyone's packages that were, like, waiting outside, and I moved them into the apartment lobby, because I am a good neighbor. And, uh, didn't want their packages to get, like, soaked in the rain. But then what I, uh... So, like, I noticed when I was moving the boxes in, that, like, one of the person's, um, like, packages was, like, VTuber merch. 
And so I felt like this would be like, I don't know anybody in my apartment complex. And I'm like, oh, cool. I probably have something in common with one of my neighbors. And I could be like, oh, hey, you like, you know, VTubers? You like watching video game streams and stuff? I don't watch VTubers, but I mean, I play video games and like streams and stuff. But I like... I feel like there is no way I can broach this conversation without like knocking on the guy's door and be being like, I looked at your mail. <laughs> Instead of being like, hey man, we could be like gamer bros, neighbors. Like that would be so cool. But <laughs> like there's no way to casually bring up like I saw your mail. I know what VTubers you watch. <laughs> like, And I wasn't like going out of my way to like stare at their packages or anything. Casually admitting to a crime. I mean, I just moved the packages so like they wouldn't get soaked Because they were outside because you can't get into my building without a key So like the mail guy has to just leave the packages on like the doorstep to the building and So I didn't want his packages were getting rained on so I brought them into the apartment lobby So like I wouldn't be you know, so they wouldn't get soaked and like ruined. I Was doing a good neighborly thing what, VTubers? Uh, I know what VTuber because it casually, it said the, um, uh, VTuber on it. Is that Mori Calliope? Is that how you say it? Calliope? Uh, the pink-haired one. Because, I mean, I saw the, the package. She seems to be, like, the most popular one. Right? I don't watch VTubing, but, like, anytime I see VTuber stuff, like, nine times out of ten, it's her. But yeah, I feel like, I mean, someone buying this stuff is probably, like, within my age demographic, and that means we probably, like, have similar interests and hobbies. Like, oh, hey, like, you like watching game streams and stuff? And I could finally have a local friend. <laughs> uh, but I, yeah, like I said, there's no way to, like, casually approach this conversation with them and be like, hey, you like VTubers, huh? And not have them be like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, close the door? I'm not googling stuff about her. But yeah, making friends as an adult is, uh, you're also a degenerate? Yeah, that's true. Yeah, making friends as an adult is so hard when you're not, like, at school or work. It's so, I, like, there's no way to approach this person and be like, Hey, what's up? Don't go to images? Oh, I mean, I did. That was the first thing I, uh, on stream. Very, yeah, very true. I wouldn't go to images on stream. But that was the first thing I went to. <laughs> but yeah, it's not a crime unless you, like, damage the mail or, like, um, remove it from the property. But I brought it into our building. And how close are you? I mean, they literally live in the exact same building as I do. Like, they're two floors below me. So, like, if they were standing in my apartment lobby, they would hear me streaming. Hey, do you like Steins Gate? <laughs> Stalk them and find a way. I, yeah, that's what I mean, though. I feel like every, like, conversation output, there's no way to not sound weird. I have, like, no, I, I also don't know what the person looks like, either. Because I don't really, like, I'm not just hanging out in my, um, my apartment lobby. So I don't know what anyone looks like in my apartment. I just saw the Cali, uh, merch. Put your channel link on everyone's door. Like gaming and VTubers? You'd probably like my YouTube channel. <laughs> Text them a picture of jelly. Oh yeah, no, I should leave the jelly tech <laughs> taped to their door. <laughs> Print out a picture of the jelly, the text from Steins Gate, and just tape it to their door. I would be like, what the fuck? Walk around with a Cali Mori shirt. <laughs> just sit in my lobby, like playing on the DS, like sit in the stairs of my apartment. And then anytime someone walks by, just like stretch. Man, just wearing a shirt of my favorite VTuber. Oh, no big deal. <laughs> sounds like a threat. Oh, the jelly thing? Yeah. Both, actually. Let's start at this tangent. <laughs> but yeah, that was the thing that happened to me today. And I just felt like there's no casual way to approach somebody about it.